said be quiet. You be quiet. Come on, Jane. No, we're, we're having a conversation. Shut your mouth, unwoman. Suck my dick. God damn. You knew the suck my dick wasn't gonna fly. That shit. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, you're gonna fly. Are you a princess? Uh, no. No, honey, I'm not. I'm a villain. After you. We'll get the next one. You don't want to ride with you me, should take it, please. Blessings to you. I want to hear that shit. She escaped. She knows. She definitely escaped. She knows. She's not a true can can Canadian. Eh? Hey? Ain't no way that they I just... A, a Riesling by the glass, please, if you have it. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Walking around like that. Excuse me. Without my man showing Did up. Did I get a bourbon neat? <laughs> oh, you about to cheat, Mrs. Waterford? So you gonna get payback? She would love one. She about to go outside. Like this motherfucker looks like... Mike Greenberg. I'm afraid I don't speak to the press. Not well, lucky me. I'm not the press. For later. No, thank you. Not a smoker. Mm. She got close to quit. So your information is out of date. Mrs. Waterford, if we could have you on a plane to Honolulu in an hour, you'd never have to go back to Gilead again. <coughs> Take it. <clears throat> Gilead blames the fertility crisis on women on their sinfulness. We see the problem often originating with the men. Now think of it. A baby of your own. And freedom. I have a child on the way. That's not your child. If you had done better research, you would know that I would never betray my country. I thought you already did. Thought you already did? What's that supposed to mean? I don't know if he's referring to her writing those letters and shit and the spanking. Right. Or is, did she do some other shady shit? How he know that, though? Uh, I think he's talking about when she helped set up Gilead and she betrayed the United States. Mm. That was her country at one point, right? It's got to be what that was. He just told you you could have a baby of your of own. Your own. It's time for your nap. Damn. Bitch. Hold up, you trying to fuck Nick's wife? I'm supposed to be eating beans. I know what a godparent is. And they don't baptize babies here. I know. I need you to watch over my baby when they kick me out of this motherfucker. Word. I want my baby to know kindness. I need her to have someone kind. So they don't do, like, to see what the gender of the baby is in Gilead? That boy downstairs is maybe 20 years maybe old. And he can tell me to do anything. He can break my jaw. And no one would say boo. What's her name? Rita? Rita? Mm -hmm. Something. Reba? I feel so bad for all of them, man. Worst. She's the worst. Worst. They can't even get into the hotel or they can't get in there because This is y'all protest? Y'all like to do some more shit than this? There you go. Uh, there wasn't nobody there yet. I'm like, y'all gotta get rowdy. Just sitting here with a... Oh, oh shit. shit. Mrs. Waterford's gonna see the sign. She gonna see the sign. 
Get this bitch. Yeah, June. A little misinformation. Shut the fuck up. He had a picture of Jew. Word. Yeah, Nick, find him. Best thing you could do. Hey, man. She's carrying my baby, too, bro. <laughs> I feel for you. you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't rape her. They made me do it. It was unpleasant. But we soldier on. It's a setup. Don't do it. Fuck her. Not cry, bitch. Yes. Fuck yes. I'm Nick. June's new baby, Danny. She all right? She's fine. She's pregnant. She's not fine. But she's pregnant. Yo, this is so crushing me. I couldn't... Yo, look the man right now. I know he's still processing. By Waterford? No. By me. <laughs> yeah. Oh! <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, you know, I mean, it would have turned out so different if he said by me. But wait, you don't understand? <laughs> nah, <laughs> yo. <laughs> people, you be for fucking monsters. You people. Get the fuck out of here. Get out. Get out. Get the fuck out of here. Get out of here. Get out. Get out. Get out. Wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you, um... You look out for her. Oh, he does. Oh, he definitely does. He does. Moira made it out. And that she's living with me now. And you tell her that I love her. And you tell her that I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stop. No matter what happens, I'm not gonna stop. You tell her that. Yeah, I'll tell her. Yeah. They trying to do it to me, yo. They trying to you do are. it to me. I'm about to cry, yo. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but... Something ain't right. I just... Start watering up, you know what I mean? Like, what's the water for? Like, I don't know what's going on. Those fucking tub letters. Finally made their ass overseas. Word. He said that conversation would have been so much different. Yeah, yo, like, <laughs> they'd have been tussling on the floor still, like, they had to pull the strap, like, you know what I mean? He can't divulge that information anyway, because he'd get his ass killed. Yeah, my dad. Well, <laughs> I have been What'd a bit spacey these days. Perfectly normal, but we must all remember to try and follow the rules. Yes, Aunt Lydia. She has a kind of heart shit. <laughs> yeah, it's like she deep fuck down, her, baby, yo, deep fuck down. Fuck Mrs. Yo. Waterford, dog. She care about her women. Nah, yo. she, she care don't care when she cattle prongin' them bitches. <laughs> <laughs> they weren't getting out of line to catch that cattle prong. They know and what it was. Cuffed the girl's hand <laughs> to the grill. When they turned the burner on, yo, she couldn't go. Mrs. Nowhere. Waterford said I have to leave the house as soon as the baby comes. Is death still on the table when I'm gone? <laughs> oh, shit. That is her prerogative. What's going to happen when the baby comes out half Puerto Rican? You know that this can be a difficult house. Why is it so smoky in there? Children need to be in a safe place. Where's Waterford been in there busting jacks? 
She probably is. Crazy. <laughs> she about to get caught by Mrs. Lydia. It's not Did good for the baby. Be a godmother. Oh shit! In the time oh, before. Oh, you speaking too much. I will make allowances for girls in your condition, but insolence is not permitted. I'm saying this baby needs protection. I would never, ever allow anything to happen to a baby. Dude, you ain't got that much power. Praise be. Praise be. There's that deep down good heart. Because she won't let nothing happen to a baby. See? <laughs> that baby ain't catching the, uh, catching the cattle crop. Until she's 12 and she don't want to <laughs> fucking... Take dick. Yeah, <laughs> it's not funny, Jack. <laughs> I was godmother to my sister's oh, child. Oh, you break in pro. I see. Let's he go. died when he was four now years old. You know what's going to happen? She's going to cut her own tongue out. Somebody's going to fuck her up this episode. She's going to get fucked up. <laughs> you lacking. <it. laughs> June must know her baby about to be you know, like come out tonight, and she's just she is begging everybody. everybody. <laughs> oh. My this name is, is Maria Garente. I'm from Somerville, Mass. They killed my wife and took our son. His name is Thomas. Doesn't she know that Nick's her boo? Does it matter the baby still belongs to Mr. Waterford? So it's Mr. Waterford's baby. So he wants But she could have been like, hey, you know. You know he fucking. You think she gonna stir that pot too? Like, we got something good going on right now. We got. <laughs> fucking letters. Damn. I thought that package was gonna have like C4 in it or whatever. Something to make Gilead go boom. This could go boom. This definitely could go boom. Yeah, yeah. On that Canada trade or whatever it is, especially. Shut that whole shit down. Yes, get that shit in the right Right hands. to the press. Fucking right. Look. Good morning, Stuart. We won't be conducting this morning's session, Mr. Waterford. Yes. You can go directly to the airport. We'll have your luggage brought down. <laughs> I don't understand. You and your wife are no longer welcome in Canada. Mm. Coward. Coward. Bitch, you take a lot of people. I don't know how you live with yourself. It's sad what they've done to you. You think that's what she wanted? You think that's what she wanted? That's definitely what she wanted. The whole thing is she thought she was going to be able to have some power too. And then she realized she gets whoopings for speaking out of turn. And now she want to have second guesses. When all the bitches around her been getting whooped and beat with guns, she didn't have a fucking problem with it then. Fuck her. Bitch sit there and lay in bed with a bitch in between her legs while her husband <laughs> rapes her. <laughs> and then steals the baby and you want me to have compassion for this bitch? Fuck her. Yeah, you remember Laura. You remember, bitch. See, right there, her as the husband at. Bow! A fist would have been through that shit. I would have had a fucking gun. A bomb. I'm taking that charge. All that shit. Fuck that. Model top. <laughs> Everybody getting it. This is so sad. This is the Ugh. worst episode <laughs> yet. Damn. Free. 
freedom of speech. Luke, I am kind of disappointed in you, though. Yeah, I'm disappointed. I feel like he ain't doing as much as he could be doing. I think he's in shock. He's still processing. Because it's, it's that close and he can't do shit, in a sense. But, yeah, my rage is just too rageful for that type of shit. As close as Moira got to that car, that's what I'm saying. I would have definitely been, been there with the hammer, that bitch. <laughs> yeah. and I would have shot somebody. I probably would have died for it, but I'm taking that. Now look where you back to. This looks nothing like around where you used to sell. Facts. I made the plane trip like 20 minutes, right? Yeah, hell yeah. Well, I don't know where are they at. I know they're like Gilead, close to D.C., DC Virginia, or somewhere. We're lucky in a lot of ways, aren't we? No. Yes, we are. We don't fuck no more. I don't love you no more. I get I'm not happy here no more. None of this is what I wanted. <laughs> you know, I'm not gonna let you fucking keep giving her bail, dog. <laughs> this bitch is evil. And now, when she gets just a little taste of the evil that everybody else is doing, she wanna fucking have a change of heart now. Nah, bitch. You should have had a change of heart when you was back slapping June. And, hey. and you cleaned up the Martha for no reason. <laughs> yeah, the Martha ain't grabbed, deserved that. Yeah, she ain't deserved just because she grabbed the bunny she rabbit put her or whatever. The door, yo. <laughs> With a left hand. Oh. You could be in Hawaii right now, sipping Mai Tais with a bunch of your girls. You know, you ain't got no friends. Word. I just want to give her a hug and everything. Just want to... You just want to fuck. And then you'll... <laughs> <laughs> then you'll be on team fucker too. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do I like you? No. Luke I said more than with him. She got out. His dude couldn't get out. But more took a car. More of walked on foot. I thought yeah, in a she, snowstorm. She did. <laughs> Seemed easy as fuck to get out of there. It did. Well, you know, she had to go through. She murdered my man. Took his whip. I met your husband. Mm. He wanted me to tell you that Moira got out too. She's. I think she's staying with him now. Could have been you, June. Oh my God, they could kill each other. <laughs> They're not the same people. Nobody's the same anymore. <laughs> Shit. Eden's probably wondering. Yes, okay. We gotta get back to that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you at least gotta give her a kiss or something, dude. Keep Word, keep giving her a cold give her a back shoulder. rub, <laughs> a little foot rub, something. So, I love you. I don't know if she got pregnant, so they might have to pull the sheet down again. Well, that was a consummation of the wedding, right? That wasn't right. I don't know how that works. They don't say I don't know how. I don't think they're allowed to have sex like just, just sex. Just sex, right? I think they have to do it in that ceremony for him, and he has to put the blanket with the little cutout hole. You think the Waterfords watch them, or they their own separate? No, nah, they got their own shit. Community for drivers yeah. <laughs> and their babies. <laughs> uh, they get well, at least you get a little bit of happiness. Is Moira is Hannah's godmother? She got out. She did it. So I can do it. I know I should accept the reality of you being born here. Make my peace. She brought her but up. fuck that. But fuck that. See what I'm saying? I knew that news wasn't going to be good. 
It's like it's, it's good. It's good, but because she had kind of given up hope and fell right back into the line. That's what I'm saying. Like she was dead, and now she's just got a whole uh, new life. It's Janine questioned her last episode when she was like, "You know, you can't see your baby." And she was mm-hmm. like, "You sound like one of them now." So now she's back to Savage. fuck y'all. I'm about to get out of this bitch. If more can do yeah. it. I can do this. Yeah, yeah. not gonna go. Just, I don't know. She All I got to car, say, she got loose. Is fuck Mrs. Waterford. <laughs> okay, I don't feel bad for her at all. Not even a little bit. You can have all that sympathy you want for. Her. Fuck her, man. I'm crying. This bitch is that. a fucking problem, man. I just want to hug her. Shit is fucking irritating as a motherfucker, man. I can't stand her ass, man. Damn. And shout out to uh, Nick, man, for coming through delivering that package That's of letters. What I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You he know what I mean? With that. That's because he do. He got love for Jimmy, though. Know? He got like real love. Oh yeah, he Jimmy. definitely cares about you. So I think that was a real. But movie. I think that's gonna be a problem. That's with, gonna be a problem with little Shorty with his girl because she found them letters. Remember? And then she said that she didn't read them, but. <laughs> She, and she know that yeah, them, them letters, letters got out. Hell yeah! And then when she figures out that them bitches got uploaded, she's gonna is tell she, either Mrs. Waterford or Mr. Did they Waterford. Even have TVs? No, but How I'm pretty she sure know? they'll figure it out somehow. You know, it, it's gonna it, turn out. Yeah, yeah, I got. Leaks you, gonna I word's gonna it. leak out at some point. Little snitching ass. She gonna be. She the actual. She the ear. She the ear. They got the eyes. And <laughs> she the ears. She the ear. She got <laughs> the knee was the mouth. They got them, yeah, they got them all, man. <laughs> Damn, dog, that shit is fucking wild. Overall, I though, another fucking solid ass episode, man. It's just sad, cried, and like, de- time. sad and depressing as a motherfucker. It hurts. Like, it does. Like it was, it was, it was kind of dope seeing Mrs. Waterford driving through Canada. And seeing all Wishing how, how yeah, life. remembering how life used to be and how she misses yeah. the shit and you can tell all of that shit. She should have took the fucking Honolulu deal. Is that what she wanted? It is what she wanted. Got she wrote the fucking policies, dog. <laughs> like, nah, I yo, remember I think the in man that took over, man. Nah, hell like, nah. Here. At some point, he told her she couldn't come to the meetings because I remember she he, he kept trying to bring her along. And then that one time That's the dude saying, was like, man, the man took over. The other dude who died. What they nah, to do, fuck man. no. She was in there writing all the fucking policies, and then they created the ce- the ceremony. They was like, well, what if we just have it till the wife is there so she can be part of it? Man, fuck Mrs. Waterford, man. Fuck her. Fuck, 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 <laughs> fuck her. <laughs> all right, fuck her. <laughs> That's what I got to say about Shit her. Damn money. Nah, man, fuck that. She, that gets, bail money. she gets no bail for me, man. She gonna bail. rot in that motherfucking prison, dog. She needs to stay her ass right there and keep getting them fucking whoopings for speaking out of turn. Fuck her. Damn. Everybody else can get the fuck up out of there, man. Man, more. See, if they were smart, more would have fucking. Luke would have grabbed more. They would have rolled a fucking map. She would have gave it to June how she got out. And she could have took that same route. Could have gave it to Nick. Yeah, yeah gave it to Nick. Nick. Bring her here, meet us there. Word. We drive this way and then run through the woods and then we there. Man. That shit was dope though when my man was like, we're not having that meeting today. You and Mrs. Waterford can head straight to the fucking yeah, airport. Go back to the fucking airport. Because <laughs> y'all are no longer welcome you in Canada. Welcome my man said, Canada what? No more. <laughs> Then he got the nerve to call this nigga a coward. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Like, what? Like, Cause he, he, oh, because he, he trying to say, like, he wanted, but now he not because... Yeah, he's trying to say that yesterday when they talked, he was agreeing with some of the shit that they had discussed, and he was telling them that they not really bad people like that, and then today the shit leaks out, and now all of a sudden you want to switch up and act like you didn't agree with none of the shit I told you yesterday's yesterday. Yesterday's terms are not today's terms. <laughs> <laughs> yesterday's exactly, prices bitch. are not today's prices. Fuck y'all. Get the fuck out of Canada, you bitches. Word. It's like Morris said. Out. They should have fucking threw his ass smooth in jail right then and there. Like, Word. Lock their ass. Treason. War crime. Lock bitch, you fucking set war up war the war. whole fucking United States and took our shit over. Fuck out of here. Yeah, the man did that. 
with the help of Mrs. Walker. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck her. But yeah, overall solid episode. We're going to check on out. If you enjoyed it, bam, hit that thumbs up. Also, make sure to share and subscribe and let us know in the comments what you thought. We'll catch y'all later. Salute the general. Homie Joe, we gone. Yeah.